If you frequently travel by the Indian Railways, then you must also know the importance of having an IRCTC account. Now, you may ask, why do I say so? Because when you book your train tickets online and you will book it through Paytm or say Google Pay or Phone Pay or any other portal, in all the cases, you absolutely need to have an IRCTC account. And if you don't have one, then how do you create it? Well, hello everyone, I'm of a Fiber by India today and in this video, let me show you the step-by-step -step process on how you can create your IRCTC account in less than five minutes. But of course, before we get started with the rest of the video, consider hitting the red subscribe button for detailed tech videos and also turn on the bell so that you don't miss any of our latest updates. With that said, let's get started. So first you need to download the IRCTC Rail Connect app on your smartphone which is available on both the Android Play Store and also on the iOS App Store. For your convenience, I'll also add the download links in the description below. Now, once you've downloaded the app, open it. Next, it will ask for permission for notifications, so allow that as well. Now we are on the dashboard and you'll see many options. You have to ignore them all and select the login option in the top right corner. Here you'll see the option for register user. You have to select that. Now we need to register and fill in some key details. One important thing that you need to keep in mind is that your mobile number and your email ID should not already be registered with IRCTC in the past because in that case you won't be able to create a new account. So do keep that in mind. So now we will start filling the form with the following details. So you need to enter your mobile number, your email ID, your username, and then you have to create a password, keep it between six to eight characters. Then you have to confirm your password, then enter your first name, middle name, last name, date of birth. You have to choose your gender, select your nationality, which is Indian, of course. Select a security question that you can remember. And of course, remember the answer as well. Next, choose your occupation and select your marital status. And once you're done, you have to click next. Now on this page, fill in your address along with the pin code. Uh, there's also a small checkbox below it. So you have to take it to avoid uh, filling the address again on the next page. Now fill in the remaining details and move forward. And if you had ticked the box earlier, you would have uh, avoided re-entering the address. But anyway, fill it again if it is necessary and then complete the capture and click register. You'll now see a congratulations message and now quickly verify your email and mobile number as you won't be able to use your account without the verification. Now click OK. Now we are back on the login page. You have to enter your username and password that we just created and tick the login and booking with OTP checkbox. This eliminates the hassle of entering the capture code. Also, since this is our first login, this step is only needed once. Now, moving forward, there will be no such hassle. So, uh, we need to verify our email ID and mobile number. First, select the send OTP option for the mobile number. Enter the OTP that you receive and then do the same process for your email ID as well. Again, a congratulations pop-up will appear, meaning your account has been created successfully. Uh, let me show you the process by logging in. So now I will enter my user ID, password and uh, capture code to log in. And uh, you'll also see an option to generate pin here. So make sure to fill this out as it will save you from entering the user ID and password again and again repeatedly. So additionally, enable the biometric option below so you can log in using your fingerprint or face unlock. And this is how in a matter of few minutes, you can create your IRCTC account. Of course, if you found this video helpful, then definitely smash that like button and also share this video with others. I will see you all in the next one. Till then, take care of yourself and thank you for watching.